These days people are asking how to boost their FPS and improve their PC performance without spending a single cent. So guys, today in this video, I'm gonna show you the free tweaking utility. Gear Booster is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you're playing games using your wired or wireless connection. This is the one of the best program for rerouting your network and help you to connecting with the nearest server of the game for achieving the better ping with lower input delay. So guys, make sure to check out the link in the description for downloading this tool and enjoy the free trial using my link in the description. So guys, in the very first step, you need to download Download this free tweak utility on your PC. Link available down in the description. Simply download this file on your PC. And guys, also before using this file, let's scan this file and find out if there's any kind of the virus inside this file. Simply guys, drag this file inside to this website that is the virus total. And here you can check it out here. 99% of the companies have detected no any kind of virus. Like you can check it out here. Malware byte undetected. Also Google Avast. And also hundred of company declared there is no any virus inside this file. So guys, you can use it without any kind of the worry. So guys, simply open up this application as administrator. And here you will find out this kind of the welcome screen. Here you can find out all the detail of this application. So guys, simply press any key from your keyboard for continue. And here you will find out the first step that is important for you to create a restore point on your PC. If you want to create a restore point, so press one from your keyboard, or you can simply skip it using the two. So guys, I suggest to create a restore point. Therefore, you can change it anytime. So press one and press enter. And here this will start creating a restore point automatically on your PC. Therefore, you can restore all the settings back to the normal. So guys, here after creating the restore point, here you will find out the tweaking screen there you will find out the tutorial general tweaks mouse and keyboard windows tweak pc cleanup memory tweaks and also multiple optimizations for your pc for improving your pc performance so guys here you find out your general tweak so press one from your keyboard and press enter inside you will find that general performance tweak so press one this will automatically do everything for you in just one click so guys here you can check it out here our operation is completed successfully now let's guys break down the changes which this will impact on our pc so guys in the very first step this settings has done some optimization for your microsoft multimedia then disable the negative core thumb and enable the tcp no delay then this is disable the fast startup disabling the hibernation disable dynamic tick and it's also do some changing for the low latency then here this is uh, set your game on the highest priority and also done a lot of optimization you can guys also read all these changes on your pc so guys once you're done now you simply scroll down and here you will find out press any key from your keyboard to continue so press continue now you need to go for the next step that is your mouse setting so press 2 from your keyboard and press enter and here you will find that optimize mouse and keyboard registry settings and second keyboard and mouse data queue size so guys press 1 from your keyboard and press enter this will optimize the settings for your mouse and keyboard mouse is done now press 2 from your keyboard and now press enter again now here you will find out high end cpu Madden CPU and low end CPU. By the way, guys, you can also comment below. I will tell you which option is best for you. But guys, I have a good PC and good CPU, so I will go with high end CPU. So press one and press enter, and this will do everything for you. I press any key from your keyboard for continue. Now let's go for the next step. That is your Windows tweak option. So press three from your keyboard and press enter. Now here you will find a disable transparency, disable notification, disable useless animation, disable telemetry and autogram. And now you can run all these commands one by one on your PC and disable all the settings on your PC that will help you to get any better performance. Now let's go for the main option again. So press M from your keyboard and press enter. Now let's go for the next step. That is your PC clean. Now press 4 from your keyboard and press enter. Now here you will find out clean temporary device data. So press 1, enter and this will delete all the temporary files from your PC. Now go for the Windows Clean Manager. Now press 2 from your keyboard, press enter, and this will open up the CCleaner on your PC. So guys, you don't need to do it if you just use the first option. You click on this cancel button. Now press any key from your keyboard for continue. Now let's go for the fifth setting. That is your memory tweak. So press 5 from your keyboard and press enter. Inside you will find out enable or disable the memory compression and general memory related tweak. So press 1 from your keyboard, press enter. Now press 1 to disable the memory compression if you have 16 GB and more RAM. And enable the memory compression if you have less than 16 GB of the RAM. So I have 16 GB of the RAM, so I will go with the disable memory compression and press enter. And this will disable this option on your PC that will help you to fix the FPS drops and lower the input delay of your mouse and keyboard. Now press any key from your keyboard. Now next you need to go for this general memory related tweak so guys press 2 from your keyboard and press enter and this will disable all this basic settings from your PC for optimizing your memory. So guys now again press any key from your keyboard to continue. So guys now you can simply skip this 6th step after that now go for the 7th step that is for your GPU optimization. So press 7 from your keyboard and press enter. Now here you will find that Nvidia GPU tweaks. AMD GPU tweaks and Intel GPU tweaks. So I will go with Nvidia because I have Nvidia GPU now press 1 from your keyboard. 
and press enter here it will show you some kind of the error so guys don't worry simply click on this ok button and this will do everything for you in just single click like this will disable nvidia telemetry disable writing combination disabling the pre-emissions and also do some settings for your nvidia profile inspector so guys once you're done now press any key from your keyboard to continue after that now let's go for the next step that is your cpu tweak so press 8 from your keyboard and press enter do not do these settings if your pc has bad overheating issues so guys click on this ok button if you have any kind of the overheating issues so guys don't use the settings otherwise i have a perfect pc so i will go with this settings. so guys press 2 from your keyboard and press enter and this will do everything for you so guys once you're done now you need to press any key from your keyboard now let's go for the next step that is your usb tweaks so press 9 from your keyboard and press enter and this will disable your usb power saving disable the usb selector suspended and also enable the msa mode on your usb for having the lowest delay out of your mouse and keyboard now press any key from your keyboard to continue let's go for the next step that is your power tweak so press 10 from your keyboard and press enter now again do not do this if your pc has bad overheating issues so guys don't worry click on this continue button now here you will find out apply ripex free power plan v3 so guys you can simply click on this one button and press enter and now select out here the performance power plan on your pc you can also watch my dedicated video how to create a best power plan on your pc for having the best performance so guys go with your high performance power plan and close out it press any key from your keyboard now go for disable power throttling timer for scaling plus more so guys press 2 and press enter and this will disable all the settings on your pc optimization of your pc so guys press any key from your keyboard now let's go for the next step that is disable power telemetry so press 3 from your keyboard and press enter and guys that's it now let's go for the next step that is delete useless power plan so guys press 4 from your keyboard and this will delete all the useless power plan from your pc so guys now press any key from your keyboard and guys that's it now here in the next step here you will find out the deep load settings if you want to remove all the deep load application from your pc but guys we not want to do it simply skip this 11th step now let's go for the next step that is the 12th you guys press 12 from your keyboard and press enter trim and defragment your drives and enable user write cache so guys simply skip this step from your pc so guys press m and press enter now let's go for the next step that is your unlock your pc full potential so guys press w from your keyboard and press enter and guys from here you can check out here all the posts from my pc and find the best one for you after that you can also go on my youtube channel and watch the related video to finding out the best settings and how to apply these packs on your pc for having the best performance out of your pc so guys once you apply all the settings now simply close out this application now you need to one time is your pc there for all the change to take effect after that turn on your pc and enjoy the best performance out of your pc or laptop i hope you love it please make sure to share your opinion about this video in the comment section and see you again in the next video so guys at the end here is the results of the uh, optimization on my pc before and after here you can check it out here after i'm getting like uh, 235 fps and before it was 280 8 fps this is depend on pc to pc i have already optimized my pc a lot so therefore i am already getting the better fps but guys uh, you can get a lot more performance out of your pc after using this free optimizer on your pc i hope you love it so guys enjoy it